Right now you're tuning in No Rap Cap Podcast Every Tuesday Every Thursday 7pm Be sure to like Comment Subscribe uh, and Tell a friend man Hit that like And hit that bell When you subscribe And hit all So you can be alerted Every time we drop New content Going forward After this premiere After every premiere uh, If you ain't a member You won't be able to watch The full episode uh, Once it ends So We suggest you Get your membership Monthly membership Just $5 Ain't gonna hurt nobody If you rock with us man We appreciate it We appreciate all the members We already have For sure. I go by Gas They hate them man <clears throat> I'm Mr. Mina The instigator J time of the mediator Fact. We back with another episode Fact. man Fact. Fact. And uh I'm going to talk to Gangster for a second. Not literally, you know what I'm saying, addressing him, but just the shit that we were talking about that he responded to uh, about your juvenile record should not be, you know, uh, lingering over your head as you become an adult. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And I ain't agreeing with Gangster. I disagree. It's just the perspective. You know what I'm saying? Uh just, 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 you know why it's a great area and it can't just go one way because the shit that the shit that we do as a juvenile, we wouldn't want the same penalty if another nigga was a juvenile and done it to us. You right. see what I'm saying? Meaning, if I'm a juvenile and I kill somebody or kill a nigga, mommy and shit, mm-hmm. I'm gonna want the pen. I, I'm not gonna want the same penalty as I want another nigga to get if he did it to my mama. You see what I'm saying? Right. Like, you kill my mom and then you 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 13 and you do ju- you you go to jail till you 18. But my people dead. Right. Mm-hmm. You go to jail four years, but my people dead. Right. You see what I'm saying? I'm never gonna see them again. But if I was committing that same act on that side of it, I'm cool with four years. That's all <laughs> I'm gonna get. Right. You see what I'm saying? Right. So that's why it can't just be just one way. Uh, nigga, shit, just shit, just close. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? They got a, a, another a, another side to that that somebody else suffer a little deep a little deeper than the situation that you that's put in front of you. You know, mm-hmm. and, and 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 for every person it should be different too. You know what I'm saying? And I was speaking on far as for this two time far as a rapper because if if you capturing if you capturing fans from the shit that you was talking about. Uh, how real that you was when you was a juvenile, you was a vice law, mm-hmm. and you repping that to juveniles at this time right. that is affecting their lifestyle, they're enticing you, influenced, they're influenced by you. When you do some flaw shit, you got to respect their mind if they care. You can't say they shouldn't care because it was a juvenile. No, they juveniles now, and you're influencing them with your mm-hmm. lifestyle, you know what I'm saying, mm-hmm. that, that you've been talking about from a juvenile to now, rapping right. on a song. Right, you're influencing right. the juvenile. And right. right now, you could more likely get killed from a juvenile way more than an adult today, in this day and age, right here. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. And... Another point that it's just an example of people play on that, and it's just an example of you know like Boots is saying. That's why I keep a young nigga with me. You see, you you playing on the shit that we saying shit just go away, and right. it's easy to go kill a nigga. It's easy for an adult nigga to send him on the mission because that gonna go away. See, you playing the shit that you saying shit just go away. Right. A nigga like Boots, that's an example. Like you playing on the shit that you saying shit go, go away. away. Right, and that's and that's 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 what make those people feel like they can commit certain acts, Facts. like you know what I'm saying, Facts. and feel like they don't have a a, a, a real enough consequence to deal with for doing it you know what I'm saying and that's why this shit look like it's a little crazy right now with so many juveniles as of right now because they get a slap on the wrist for doing mm-hmm. crimes that they know should hold some weight at the end of the day you know right you mad at them because they only got to live four years three four years you know what I'm saying juvenile life and you know I don't I, you know not like not, not knowing what, what gangster might have meant but you know sometimes people just feel like people when they at a young age like that they just you know, they made a mistake. You know what I'm saying? And some people feel like, you know, people deserve a second chance at life. You know what I'm saying? Or uh, all for be- making an immature move. Like, whether they kill somebody, call Jack somebody, did anything that was considered wrong. It's just like, these kids just was uh, highly immature. So, you know, maybe that's why they're saying, like, you know what I'm saying, they shouldn't. Well, that can't go for everybody. That's for certain people. Because like I said... Nigga not making no mistake if a adult nigga saying I keep you with with me to go send you on a mission. That ain't no mistake. You know what I'm saying? So it can't be for everybody. That's why I say this shit got a gray area. It just got it gotta be both ways depending on who you're talking about. Because if it go just one way, 
to the opposite side going to be fucked every time for as the victim side the of the family. Side. Right, right. I totally agree on that. You know, I totally agree. Like, like I said, there's a, it's crazy, like, you know what I'm saying, because we're all dealing with juveniles. We're all dealing with immature people, like, you know what I'm saying, and everybody at an immature age have made some type of mistakes, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, it is, like, kind of crazy in that situation because, on the other side, that you know what I'm saying, them people don't want to hear that. You know what I'm saying? I can't get my mama back, my brother back, or whoever. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day. So it is and, right. and, and on the flip side of all that, I'm a nigga who caught her on robbery charge at 13 and robbed a lady with a BB gun. I stayed in revolt a year till I made 14 until they decided if they wanted to try me as an adult or not. Instead of getting juvenile life, they was trying to see, I'm in that bitch going crazy because I'm in there a whole year trying to see if I'm going to get 5 to 99, get tried as an adult. So I understand it on that side too, bro, because nigga, I don't want no 5 to 99. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> I want to be tried as a juvenile. Yeah, right. Right. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, right. I'm, I'm I'm speaking on that because this is something that happened to me. Right. So I get what a nigga saying. You see what I'm saying? But, and also that it, it wouldn't make no difference because I'm a convicted felon as an adult right now. You know what I'm saying? But I wouldn't want my childhood the way I live and my conviction to stop me from getting a job here and getting a job over there. Right. So I understand it. You know that's, what I'm yeah, saying? That's why I say it's, 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 it's ugly. Like you said, there's a great spot in the, in the mix of that. Like You know what I'm saying? And, 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 and then... This shit, like I said, bro, this conversation could go on, on and on and on forever. Because if you a rat as a juvenile uh, adult, that's in the streets, in, in, in the streets' eyes. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to be that as a juvenile. You don't want you don't want that 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 rap on you like that. But if you was a killer as a juvenile, you know what I'm saying? All the way to adult, you gonna honor that. You want rep that. You glad that people recognize you as that from being a juvenile. Right. You see what I'm saying? Right. So right. I that shit. This shit could go on and on. I could yeah. give so I could justify this shit by I'm saying so much yeah. shit. You different. know what I'm saying? <laughs> because because if the streets not agreeing. You know what I'm saying? With the red jacket. That ain't something you want to be as a juvenile. Right. Mm. But a killer you do. A killer. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you nigga, 12 years old, knocking shit off. You want that That's jacket. me. Yeah. You want that You want that yeah, jacket. Right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. They don't want that adult time. <laughs> you don't want that adult time. <laughs> right. He real talk. Right. Hey, right. Yeah. That, that, that's deep. That's deep. Like, uh, mm-hmm. So gangster, you know what I'm saying? The man got a strong point on that. You know what I'm saying? Real talk. You know what I'm saying? You really got a strong point on that. So it is a little great spot. And like I said, that shit can go on. But it's all about perspective. You know what I'm saying? Everybody have a perspective on how they feel it should go or whatever. That don't make it right or wrong. That just make it your perspective, your opinion. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And, and, and believe it or not, bro, like just talking about just all that shit and and – just from from the heart, my nigga. If you if if you a nigga who don't gotta get involved in none of that shit, so it wouldn't matter. You know what I'm saying? To be even be on your jacket, ratting, killer, convicted felon. Right. You don't need to go that way. You know what I'm saying? If you could change it up, change it up, bro. Right. Because we talk about jail, we talk about people that ain't never coming home, but it, that's all it be. We say it. People here and we get off of that. Nah, a nigga got to reflect and really, really understand what a nigga saying. Like life, my nigga, you ain't coming home no more. You know what I'm saying? Right. You get involved in them activities that we talking about. You know what I'm saying? So just need to free yourself away from all of that shit. You know what I'm saying? How you feel about the guys that get caught on default with that? Meaning like <clears throat> you young you run with a group of people, some things happen, and then you get caught in. Sometimes you get caught in beef that it wasn't it wasn't on you. You know, it was like the, the crew of people you ran with, and the shit just linger on in your life. Like, even, maybe one of the dudes that committed a crime or committed a murder went to jail or got killed, but it don't stop like that. Like, you know what I'm saying? These guys that maybe want to pull away from that lifestyle are kind of trapped into it because the, 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 the people that they're going against don't quit because you want to quit. Right, right. And if you love your life and you love the people that support you and you love the people that you support that count on you, you'll make a way. If it's relocating, changing your whole life up because the main thing is you trying to stay uh, alive. You know what I'm saying? Right. And, and, and that's what that that's the best answer, bro. You got to relocate and you can't get caught up into the politics of I'm running I'm scared. Right. Nah, bro, because you got to be there for the people that support you and the people that love, that you. love you. You know what I'm right. saying? Yeah, and, and, and that's just like I said once before 
and then you start, you it's like you start playing chess. You gotta let a nigga self destruct because he gonna get into it with somebody else anyway. Right. You know what I'm saying? He yeah. got it up with some other niggas. If you can survive mm-hmm. that long, like you know what I'm saying? Because the way these little guys just spend all their time spending on somebody or, or, or hunting you down, like 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 uh, like you deal, or like you a deal or a rabbit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I know, bro. Like, you know how somebody will get killed and nobody don't know what happened. You know what I'm saying? Nobody don't know what happened. He was a good dude. I don't know why they did that to him. Bro, people be knowing they self what happened. You know what I'm saying? They be knowing what they into Meaning or what they got they, going on. So the, the, person the person who got killed, killed right. they be knowing what happening, dog. Yeah. You know what I'm right. saying? You know you caught them into some so. That shit have played the shit. The shit that played mind games with you, dog. Like, nah, I ain't gotta tell nobody. Uh, I'm a man. I'm gonna stand on business, nigga. Come through, woo, woo, woo. Mm-hmm. and you know for real, for real in your heart, bro. That that's not what it is. See, your partners around you. That's why your partners always know. Your family members don't know right. because. You was you, you was talking like that around your partners. Fucking man, nigga, come, we gonna stand on business. Woo, woo. You see, you just portraying the image for a nigga who front you think that. like that. So it's causing you to be like that in front of him when you know you ain't really like that. And then you get caught slipping, and then you did. And that nigga saying, damn, guys. Right. Well, mm-hmm. How the fuck that happened? Man, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. But your people saying otherwise, man, just got his GED, just was about to go off to college. Nah, mm-hmm. man, this nigga's been spinning too. 